you know, I think character uh, gets revealed not when everything is going smoothly, but when faced with adversity. Even immediately right after the tornado, uh, every, everybody dug in. And uh, I don't think there was any question about, you know, this was home and uh, nobody else wanted to go anywhere else. The community itself, right from the start, you had neighbor helping neighbor, um, people from neighboring towns, from Applington over to Parkersburg. Um, it was it was something to behold, something that I'm proud to say I witnessed. You know, I think we're very fortunate to live in Iowa because only in Iowa, our community of 2,000 people have 2,000 volunteers showing up for two straight weeks, um, showing up to help in any way they could. Different areas in the country have dealt with tornadoes and hurricanes, and I've been through a hurricane, and I, and I, I could see a huge difference in uh, the attitudes of people here. As a community, we really felt for one another, and those who were hurting most, or maybe insurance-wise wasn't the best, people did reach out to try to help them out. That was the biggest thing I saw after that tornado. All of a sudden, the property line didn't really matter to people or this or that, because there was no homes for either side, and I've never seen a sense of community like I did, you know, in that year after the tornado, and even the way the community stayed together after my father's death. Uh, the initial shock that day was, it was unbelievable. Um, so it was a great time of sorrow. We were still reeling from effects of the tornado and dealing with that and then uh, to have Ed taken away. Uh, the family was incredibly strong. Character is one of those things you can't just turn it on and off. It's a, it's a process and you know I couldn't dream up June 24th 2009 but was prepared for it. and I think I was prepared because I live in a great community. I had great teachers. I had that sense of right or wrong. I got to watch my dad for 13 months deal with the adversity of losing his home, losing the high school. You could see Ed's ways and his way of life actually come out from all the kids and everybody else in the community that has known him and dealt with him. Mr. Thomas, Coach Thomas, um, Ed was a role model for so many people and he would have been so proud of the way his family became the role model. My dad often said, but please never forget where you came from. Now for me as a father, it's so neat to see my kids doing the exact same things that I had the opportunities to do so many years ago and to see their love for Parkersburg and for Applington Parkersburg uh, just grow in a place that they think is truly special. To be kind of noted for your character, uh, for your rebuilding following tragic times, um, what an honor. Um, it, it hits you right in the heart. It's something to be prideful about. Um, I'd like to think that we earned it and uh, it's just a great place to live. It took every single member in our community um, to respond, to be recognized as a community of character, but something I know I'm extremely proud of and, and as a community we'll be extremely proud of this honor is there's so many great towns and great communities in the state of Iowa and ours, for ours to be honored um, is truly humbling, um, but we're very excited and feel extremely fortunate. Mm -hmm.